So it's a beautiful morning in Carmel, and uh, I've been working on the concepts of 145 blues, uh, specifically the fact that we, if we're in the key of A, and E is a really good one, but you know, if you want to get break outside the mold, and we, we did this. That's a really good one, and it broadens your horizons and makes you stop and think about the numbers. Well, in A, there's your one, there's your five, and the boogie sound is one, five, six, flat seven. And that takes you from that, this sound goes flat three, three, five. So let's put a pin in that. And look at the D, the four chord. Well, in this position, here's our D, pinky on the one, one, three, five, six, flat seven, one, three, one, three, five, one, seven, six, five. So that gives you another place to go. And the reason I say that is because when we're on the four chord, remember it's four bars of one, and then two bars of four, and then a bar of five, and we're gonna come to this in a second, but there's a cool way to go to the five, but so we're on the four chord. There's a, there's a holding a one position. We're, we're playing off the actual C shape, D shape, because remember our D is really an extension of a C shape. One, three, five, one. You know, you're playing a regular old country D. Remember, there's a C shape that's associated with that D chord. So it's good to, it feels, it feels a little bit mechanical at first to play in this position, but it's healthy to A, practice, because your fingers and your memory muscle will take over. So, so now when we got two bars of D, you can go. So now let's look at the A. We're going with the A-shaped A, five, one, three. So we have a five, excuse me, a one and a five. So we got one. So in this A shape, five, one, three, here's our five, six, flat seven. Same rules apply, we just have a different shape and it's, it's, you can get you know, bogged down with the bookkeeping, but you, your instincts will take over with practice. There's the key, so. There's the turnaround, the five. The five is an E7, and you wanna know where that five note is. There's the five, it's an E. It's an E note, so that's the turnaround, which means we're going back to our one, A. So there's 12 bars with a one, four, five in A. And we can now, if we're looking for something else to do, by the way, cadence and the continuity of your foot tapping 
as the song goes, is key. And I know that we struggle with that sometimes, but um, to, to end on the five and go to the one, A7. And you'll feel four bars as it comes around. Nearest the D7. Back to the one. Five. Four. One. So we got. So right there, I went, I went to a whole new paradigm, and that's the, the sort of the payoff for no, knowing your, uh, your ditty that you're doing, your tune, in different positions on the neck. What we did down here, kind of country blues. Now we're gonna come up here. Here's an, here's an A chord, barred A chord. Well, there's our one, here's our three. So we get a one, flat, three, three, four, three, one. And then when we bang that, kind of that home position, we're playing a flat seven, three, five, one. So we can get into a groove here. Uh, and then our four chord, so this is our one, here's our four, here's our five, A, D, E. Well, our D chord, a nine chord is really cool. There's our five chord, E9. 